Let him go. Come on, boy. Hey. Well, try to. Hey, sure. Sorry, boys. She didn't give me a whole lot of choice. Hello, John. Welcome to paradise. Hello, Marshal. <laughs> Might have known you'd survive. What's going on? Do I look like I commune with the undead? Yeah. Well, no. Well, then how would I know? My job is to take care of the folk who live here. Oh, you uh, <laughs> heard that one. How's that going? How's that going? Well, let me put it to you this way. Cattle rustling and bank robbery are at an all-time low. But murder, blood drinking, and psychotic episodes seem to be somewhat prevalent. Hmm. Either that, or I'm dreaming. That's what I'm hoping, too. How was it getting in here? It was crazy. Oh, they must be hiding again. They come in and then just disappear. Town's been nearly overrun a couple of times. Now we're low on ammunition, and I'm two men down. I'll help you clear the place out if you like. You're a good man, John Marston. But before that, I'm gonna need my deputies back. What happened to them two clowns you had before? Gone? Maybe. I sent Jonah off to look for Eli. They've both been gone for several hours now. Who'd want to eat one of them? <laughs> That's a good question. Where'd you send them? Out near the general store. Jonah's got one of these new guns. I'm sure he can't run into any trouble. Is that sort of? These things, they'd stop an elephant. Thank you. No, thank you. I'm sure you got your own troubles. Now, uh, what happened to the little, like, kid that was in the window? Is this real? What? Hey, mister. Hey, Pard. You seen a couple deputies nearby? Marshall's boys. Jonah and Eli. Uh are they Jews, mister? They sound like Jews. I don't know. Why? Why? <laughs> this whole thing is nothing but oh a Jewish God. plot. You do know that, don't you? I find that highly unlikely, amigo. Well, I don't like Jews. Or colored folk. Or natives, now that you mention it. Well, you're a nice, kind-hearted man to meet in a time of trouble. Kind does not come into it. Why? What are you talking about? Why? I bet you like Catholics. I can't stand them neither. Nor women. <laughs> Fabians, socialists, homosexuals, Asians, or British. Between them, they've ruined this country. Ruined it! It was a good country once! Now people are eating each other, and it's all the fault of the Jewish, British, Catholic, homosexual elite and their ideas. Well, I, for one, won't stand for it. Have you ever met a Jewish person? <laughs> Thankfully not. Or a British Catholic homosexual? Not in my store. Oh, I, I get it. I see you acting clever. Well, let me tell you this. The Jews killed Lincoln. That's why there is a triangle on the money. And they run Europe like one of them Arabian harems. Now they've sent this here plague to kill all us decent folk. Yep. You, sir, are truly a remarkable fella. Thank you kindly. I must say, it's a rare pleasure to meet someone with such a grasp on human history. You take care of yourself. I'd hate to see you get savaged by someone and watch the life force drain from your hate-filled body. <sighs> hey, hold on there. Why don't you join me in my fight, sir? It's not too late. I fear it is for me. Then I will fight them alone. All of them. America is the land of the free. And that means free to people like me. Herbert 
Boom! Absolutely. Oh, oh, no, no! <laughs> so I could buy stuff, but guess not. What is this game? Is this 2018 all over? Or World War II and 2018? God bless it. Alright. Um... I do need the ammo up here to be safe. Uh, hopefully it's pistol ammo, because that's what I desperately need. Oh, I can try to actually go kill people, no problem. There it is. That's it? Eight? Brothers. There's a massive chest and I hit the little one. Okay. Did I find him? Wait. He ends up here. Duh. Marshall sent me and needs some help. Guess you got other plans. Seriously, enjoy your meal, no problem. Easy now, gentlemen. Remember all the fun times we had? Bye, guys. You never did have a brain between you. Uh. Oh, they better have ammo on them. And we'll head back to the marshal's office. I guess it's another quest done. To a degree. And we do need to kill the graveyards, too, so we'll clear it. Oh, free. That means they gotta burn down the place. Hello, John. Hello, Marshal. So, you find the boys? I found them. I understand. Oh, it was fast for them. It was fast. And they died with their bellies full. Well, one of them did. Good. That there's Jonah's gun. Here, you keep it. After all, you earned it. Thank you. <sighs> Take care of yourself, John. You too, Marshal. Dinner for two complete. Alright, so let's go ahead and go over here to the chapel. I think it's right here, isn't it? The graveyard I'm looking for. No. There is no graveyard in Armadillo. Oh god, that's a Twin Rocks freaking place. Uh, that's the way. 
I am so sorry. I just killed two innocents for no reason. I will use their ammo safe. Oh, it's gonna go. kiss chapel because that was what Seth said to do. At least I shot those guys in the head, so it's painful. way to do this is just go ahead and burn them all and then put them killing that. Better when they give you ammo like that. Ammo's useful. I can do that too. Chapel, and then we'll move on. Please! Alright, what? As expected. Alright. Even though the horse was behind us, now it's in front of us, you know. Game Red Dead logic. Alright. Uh. So many places I do need to check out. But I think our next goal will be oh. checking on the snake oil salesman known as Blank. I don't remember that. I 
it's gonna drop me nuts till we get there. Let's go. Like you have you you're with it for like half the game. I know it's been like four years. But 